वॉट आर द एडवांटेजेस ऑफ की होल स्पाइन सर्जरी मैंने पेशेंट वॉन्स से वॉन्स टू गो हेड विथ ए की होल स्पाइन सर्जरी ऑब्वियसली ई वॉन्ट्स टू नो वॉट आर द एडवांटेजेस ऑफ की होल स्पाइन स्पाइन सर्जरी कंपेयर टू एन ओपन स्पाइन सर्जरी अनलेस देर आर सिग्निफिकेंट एडवांटेजेस देर इज नो पॉइंट इन गोइंग फॉर ए न्यूअर टेक्नोलॉजी सो लेट मी टेल यू वॉट आर द एडवांटेजेस ऑफ की होल स्पाइन सर्जरी basically the cuvel spine surgery involves lesser collateral damage to the tissues and higher uh, higher accuracy and safety in removing the disease so how does it translate into a uh, real life situation so in cuvel spine surgery the skin incision which are going to take is less than 1 cm so it translates into a better cosmetic appearance the skin incision is in 1 cm and once it heals it's usually not seen it's so small that unless you come very closer to the skin and examine it you will not be able to able to identify the incision so this is much cosmetically appealing and this is particularly used for young boys and girls or young people who are much worried about the cosmetic appearance second it causes very little damage to the muscle the instrument is of is uh, the thickness of the instrument is once less than 1 cm usually 6.8 mm so when we pass through the in the instrument through the skin through the muscle to the slip disc the amount of damage it causes to the muscle is negligible this translates into less post operative muscle pain uh, less bleeding less post operative stay in the hospital and early return back to the work and also it causes less pain on a long term we call it this is called fail back surgery syndrome which is common after such after an open surgery this is because of damage to the muscle so after an open uh, spine surgery these patients can have a new back pain which is because of damage to the muscle and bones in minimal invasive spine surgery because the damage to the muscle and bones is minimal so the patients will not experience a new pain because of damage to the muscle third one we are not causing we are not causing any or any damage to the bone or we are removing very little amount of bone in minimal invasive or key hole spine surgery so naturally as i have told before the amount of pain in the post operative period is less the amount of bleeding is less the patient will be able to return back very quickly to work sometimes within a single day will be able to carry on the uh, uh, surgery as a day care surgery and the long term effects because of damage to the bone are not less and the most important advantage is because this keyhole surgery is done under brilliant illumination and a and a larger magnification and clarity the safety increases so the incidence of nerve damage is very very low uh, the incidence of nerve damage is very low and the chances of removal of the pathology becomes higher so overall it translates into better efficacy of surgery higher success rate and very little complication rate compared to open spine surgery thank you